Hey guys, Shea Bear 1000 here. Today we're going to put these two items to the test. We're going to do a comparison and a review on both of them. Stay tuned, we'll be right back with you. Okay, what we're going to do is we got monkey got this uh, chopper thing today at flea market so we're going to try this out we're going to review that but we're also going to put it up against this one the one I've got the chopper the spinner slicer super slicer so we're going to we're going to do that we're going to get these opened up and what we got here We've got a whole bunch of different stuff we're going to try. We're probably not going to try every attachment, but here's what we got. We've got um, we've got eggs because this one will beat and like mix. So we've got eggs, and then we've got um, some boiled eggs over here because you can um, chop eggs up with this one, the one monkey's got. We've got mushrooms, tomatoes, cheese, we're going to grate some cheese, we've got an onion, some potatoes, we've got an apple, <clears throat> hers also has a juicer, a juicer thing in it, so we've got a couple of their, what are these, mandarins or? Tangerines. Like a tangerine type, mandarins? Tangerines. No, I think they're mandarins. Beer? Yeah. Halo. 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 Halo, everybody. Alright, so we got these tangerines, same thing, whatever. Like I said, we got the eggs. We've got a cucumber, we've got some carrots, and we've got some, yeah, uh, celery. Got a knife here just in case the monkey wants to slice me up or something. Uh, so, all right, let's go ahead and get you down here. Maybe you can see something, kind of. All right, let's get hers opened up. Uh, and all, all this food that we have here, none of it is going to go to waste. We're gonna make a, I'm gonna make a big pot of mulligan stew. Mulligan stew. It's just kind of like a, a vegetable. A vegetable soup or vegetable stew. Uh, okay. Now, let's get hers out here. Let's see what's in here. All kinds of goodies. Okay. Like I said, we're not going to do every single... Um, we're not going to do every single attachment, but we're going to check this out. And... Up. All kinds of stuff in here. She gave from the flea market, like I said, she gave there was seven dollars a piece, and I got this one for five dollars. So, so it's got all this stuff in it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this, this stuff out here. And get it situated for you guys and I'll be back with you momentarily I do have an assistant tonight who is going to help us uh, do this stuff together okay guys we're back we have our assistant monkey hi okay she's going to be handing food and stuff to us so all right what we're going to start out with just a couple things we're not going to do all the attachments like I said just too many but you know just enough to get the idea Okay, so what it, what it comes with, this serves, what it comes with is one of these things, and that is to clean this out. How can I do this? So you can see it fits perfect to clean that out. Okay. So what we're going to do, we're going to, um, first we're, you know, there's a couple different, there's three of these, these things here. They're very short. But we're going to do the, uh, 
Is that the smallest one? The squares? Yeah, this yeah. is for French fries. So we're yeah. gonna we're gonna do that first. Okay. And just this this is all self explanatory. But it, hers does come with instructions. Mine probably did too, but these boxes have been open, but they're flea market. They've never been used. Hers is still, everything was in the plastic, but they've never been used, so I think he gets, like, discounted because the boxes. Right. You I know, think they came from stores or something. Yeah, because, see, the boxes yeah. are kind of, and same way with, like, the other stuff, the boxes. Mm -hmm. So, and he gets them discounted. I'm guessing, I don't know for sure, I can't speak for him, but. And then we'll be showing you this, which mine does not have one of these. We'll go over, you know, like what mine has and hers don't, and what hers has and mine don't. So mine don't have one of these. It's, an, you know, you just put your egg in there and slice it. But again, hers, she can't whip an egg. She can't beat an egg, but I can. So we may end up keeping both of these. We'll see. <laughs> um, but she, she has one similar one of these kind of things but she cut her finger on it so or as she said cut I'm her finger scared off to so all right we're, we're gonna let's make a we're gonna do this pretty short mm -hmm. you uh, ready yeah let's do a potato all right got a potato in there uh -huh. all right here we go guys let's zoom in on this a little bit all right get you down here and close and maybe if I do it this way, there we go. And just push down on it. Well, I didn't have it in the center, but. Yay! It worked! Now. So, not a, not a big potato. We just got small potatoes because we need to, we have some up there and we need to get them ate up, so. So yeah, that'll That's be. nice! We can make french nice. fries. Woo! Now, let's do. Let's do a mushroom. Okay. Yeah, we can make French fries. Mm-hmm. Nice. Easy? Yeah. Nice to. Mm -hmm. and these are dishwasher safe. So, and it oh. diced them up pretty nice. I like that. Okay. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's right. fun. Now fun? Yeah. We'll try a tomato. Can you use that? Well, you wanna, might want to take that stuff out before you use the tomato. Why? We're going to put tomato juice in that? It, it's all going to go in a stew anyway. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Sorry. So, um, okay, let's just, do tomato. Can I just cut one of these tomatoes in half for me, please? Mm -hmm. I'll be right back. Well, here. Here, I'll cut it. I'll get it. Because we're kind of rolling here. So let's see what it does with the tomato. And, and this has non-slip on it. Mine does as well. So, some blood might be alright. Mm. Push it. Down. Go ahead. Okay, here I go. One, two, three. Ooh, push it. What happened? Just went through. Okay, uh, so uh, uh, there you go. It dices tomatoes oh, it diced up too. It. Yeah. Oh, let me see. Oh, how cool. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna like this. Okay, so that 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 works good. Yeah. Now, in order, set that aside. Mm-hmm. Um. Let's see. We should have a pot here. I so I can dump this stuff in. Okay. Let me find one for Okay. Um, as you've seen, I just took this off. That you have to take off in order to use this thing. Like that. So. And that just pops out. I'll put this in a pan. Aren't you going to rinse it out? Because it's all together anyway. It's going to be in a little stew. There yeah. you go. Okay. My lovely assistant. I'm going to leave it right here. Alright, now. Let's do. Alright, let's do. Let's do an egg thing. You want to do the egg thing? Okay. Okay. Set the 
this way for you. There's the eggs. They're hard. It's in here. Oh. Okay. And it just sits in there. Uh huh. And. Oh, how pretty! Oh, I like that. Oh, I Very really nice. like this. Very nice. Oh okay. yeah. Let's set this back in there because the eggs won't, won't go no. into that. That's cool. Okay, so that is nice. And it was easy too. It was just yeah. Done. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Now, you want to slice something up? Do here, huh? What are you gonna do? Slicer. Now the slicer, you're gonna need this attachment, and it just goes on there just like the lid goes. Pops down on. Mm -hmm. Down on there, and then your slicer. Be careful. There, there's a, a plus and a minus. Right. There's a plus. There's the minus. So you line this up. The plus and the minus. So, just like this. Does it go that way? Yes. So you kind of really got to be Slide careful in. or you could cut yourself. Now this, this, this one here with the, it, see it's, it's kind of medieval looking. Yeah. It so, is. and as you can see the, just line your plus and, your plus and plus up and your minus and minus up. Okay. And this one is, it's a fine slicer. Okay. So we're going to see how well this works. So, go like this. You use uh -huh. this, right? Yes, you got to use that. Okay. Yeah. So, if so you want to slice this way. Onion? Um, let's see. The... Hmm? I don't know. The onion. Do the onion? Mm-hmm. Or do you want to do a tomato? Yeah, we can do the half a tomato and see how it comes out. You just want to do half of it or you want to do a whole tomato? Well, I thought... It well, it's a fine slice. What... Let's see, what do they got on here? Can you use cucumber, an onion, carrot? Mm-hmm. Alright, let's do a carrot. Okay, we'll do carrot first. Do a carrot. Okay. And then slowly slice it like that. Then it has to turn this way. Uh-huh. No. No. Mm. Well, let's do half a tomato then. Alright. This way. <laughs> Why didn't you tell me I had the tomato in there wrong? Yeah, the tomato in there wrong, babe. tomato and you end up with that. I guess if you wanted to make like a salsa you would use that. Because yeah. it would be more it's juicy. Fine. It's kind of like julienne or whatever you call it. Hmm. See that? You, but what you if a can't. cucumber? Maybe. I know, see, and that's what yeah, scares see, me that with that. Yeah. I uh, maybe so when it's doing it. Alright. Let's um let's try a cucumber here. Okay. I don't like this slicer. No. It's a fine slicer, but I don't know. Maybe a the cheese. Maybe a potato here. You got the blade in room. <laughs> plus to plus, minus to minus. So if it's in there wrong, 
pick it up with Well, that kind of makes it really fine. You could probably use it for like chocolate. You know how you want to get it fine for top of a cake or something like that? Okay. That might be good for that. It's fine. It's very, very fine. This yeah. is for like, um, I would say, hash browns. Yeah. You probably wouldn't use that one very much, I wouldn't think. Because, I mean, you can use the tomato and the cucumbers on those square things, too. So, I don't know if I like that one too much. Let's try this one. This is just a normal slicer. Now this is bigger. Oh, I see. Okay. That would be good for my um, cucumber salad that I make. Mm -hmm. That so would be see good. Because like. you don't want them too thick when you yeah. make that. You just want them like that. That's nice, babe. Let me try this one. <laughs> oh, yeah. See, that's really, really nice, guys. See? Yeah. Um, mm. I love let's try a carrot one. Mm. Oh, that looks good. That worked yeah, out not bad. Carrot? Yeah. Give you Some carrot chips. Carrot chips? Yeah. Alright, so there's that. Mm hmm. Let's see. Very didn't nice. I have a piece of a potato, or did I do it all in there? You did it all. What happened to the other one? You only made three. Well, okay, so let's try a potato. See how thin it is. Maybe I'll make homemade potato chips. Yeah. For fried potatoes. Yeah. That worked out good. This fills up pretty quick, but that's okay. Alright, so there's that. Did the cucumber? Okay, mm -hmm. cool. Yeah. Just out of curiosity. Yes, dear. I'm so scared now of them. I know, baby. Oh, it was bad. So let's see how well this one did. Hmm. That. Oh, that's nice. That'll be great for tomatoes nice, on a hamburger tomatoes. and stuff. You don't yeah. have to have them too thick if you don't want to. Right. Or a salad. You know, you don't want to always want them thick, you know. I what always chop them up with my either. knife and always seem to be too thick or... Okay, so now... Uh, cheese grater. Let's try the cheese grater. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. And just slide right out. Alright, let's do... It also has a smaller one. Do you want to empty that first? Okay. We can put this in there. We're going to use it all the same, right? Yeah, this is just vegetable stuff. There we go. Oh, very cool, babe. I think I'll be fine. Now you want to whack me off a piece of cheese? All right, we're going to try the cheese grater now. I'm making a mess, but mm -hmm. sorry. Piece of cheese. Right. Cheese in there. Ugh. Huh. That doesn't seem to want to work well. Is it too small? doing nothing. Hmm. That didn't do crap. Hmm. So. Hmm. Oh, guys. 
Hmm. Maybe we can try this one on the cheese. Yeah, I don't like that. I just mm -mm. don't like that at all. Yeah. Maybe it's good for something. You know, I don't know. I'm not a chef. So. No, but it'll be good to have these. These different things. And we'll get used to it too. I mean, you know, it yeah. takes time to, to explore it a little bit. No. It's just, I'm sorry, but no. It's no. just not, no. So, no on the G's. Okay, that's because I need to put this one in. The cheese grater. Mm. Cheese grater. Well, it just says grater, but that's what you do with cheese, right? Grate it. Oh, we're doing it now. Is it? Yeah. You see it? Very barely. Okay, so I don't like that. Alright. Um, I, I just don't like that. No. No. Mm -mm. The other ones were okay so far, though. Yeah, I mean, you know, maybe, you know, I, I don't know. I just don't know what I'm doing wrong. But, um. Right. You want to do the juicer? Yes. Okay, let's do the juicer. We're going to do these. Yeah, you just cut it in half. You want to cut it in half and leave the skin on it? Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Now, this just goes... I don't think mine has a juicer, does it? No, I don't think so. So let's just. We put lime in there and lemon mm -hmm. so we can make our own drink with it. Woo! That. So, yeah, I mean, it's a juicer, all juicers work. Just some better than others. So yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it works. So yeah, it's it's okay. Um, sure. small and it is an apple so right yeah. but it worked yeah it worked yeah cool yeah okay so eh, you know try the carrot the carrot in the little this little one I don't know if you can use that one try the carrot in here yeah. mm -hmm. yeah, use the baby one Carrot worked good. Cool. All right. So that's pretty much this one. What do you think? I like it. I think my favorite is the egg slicer. Yeah, I like that one a lot too. And I like the other, the bigger square one we used, the first one for the cucumbers, and uh, yeah. I liked it too. All right. Yeah. Okay. And the mushroom, I like. So now what more. we're going to do 
is, well, we didn't do any of this. We didn't do the celery, didn't do the onion. We didn't do the onion, did we? Nah. Mm-mm. Okay. Well, it's kind of a big onion, but we're going to try it. We can cut it in half. not going to switch them out as much as we are right now because we're kind yeah. of just showing it. You'll know what you want and yeah. just do it. Right. See, it's a, it's a big onion, but let's try it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Cool, babe. It's pretty fast. Yeah. So, yeah, You that's can make nice. onion rings with that. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. We Hold can make, and mm -hmm. then we can put the onions in. Ooh, that looks good. Yeah. Ooh, he's going to make me a nice dinner tomorrow with mm -hmm. this. <laughs> okay, there's that. Mm-hmm. Um, let me see. You know what? I need to try. Mm-hmm. Put an egg down through there. A hard egg? Hmm? A hard egg? No, 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 honey. Oh. No, the hard boiled egg. Mm-hmm. I don't want to waste an egg. Let me dump this out. You want it? Huh? No, because it's got half of it. Mm-hmm. Okay. small one. So, let's try the big one. Where do I put it? Right here. Oh, that's nice. There we go. Oh yeah, that would be nice for, for egg salad. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah very nice. It'll really be nice. I like it. I really do like it. Um, Very nice. You know, wow. yeah, I didn't like that grater on the cheese, so that was kind of disappointing. Yeah. But I think overall, yeah, I, I do like it a lot. Yeah. You can clean it out. Well, I'm supposed to. Yeah. You know, it is what it is. I mean, seven bucks, what the hell? Right. Well... You know, we got a good deal on it. Yeah. We really did. And and I like it. And I will probably use it quite a bit, you know, for mm -hmm. things. Because I don't like to use the knife. And right. I always don't cut it right or it gets too too sick, right. too thin, too something. Okay, so. now we're going to clean this up. And we're going to break out mine. Okay, we're back. A couple of little things I want to show you about this one. Um, 
This is called the Super Slicer. It's by Cookworks. Okay. Um, what I want to show you, I don't know if the camera can pick it up. Yeah, you can pick it up a little bit here. This is also a measuring cup. It will measure up to six cups, 48 ounces, or 1,500 milliliters. So it's also a measuring cup. Uh, it's it's the non-skid thing too. Um, okay, for, well, first what I want to show you, I, I you know, um, this this is to this is a spinner. Okay, um, you put put the lid on here. Well, you got to get it right, and then you you turn it, and that locks it in. Okay, see. Locks it in. What this does is you can put um, lettuce, cabbage, herbs, or whatnot in there. You know, because you like to rinse your your lettuce or, or cabbage in in like ice cold water to keep it crisp and fresh. And then you just is that picking that up. Mhm. Mm put it right there. And then spin it. And that spins all the water out of it. So, I just want to show you that. I'm not going to really demonstrate that. And now, like hers, you know, the, the top, you had to fiddle with it to kind of get it to go on. This, this will lock in. If I can get you to show that little tab there. You line that up and you turn it and it locks into position there. So now this hole is pretty cool. We'll get to that in a minute. Uh, all right. So she wants to do the chopper first, right? Yeah. So here's chop, the chop. chopper. Yep, chop chop. Three stainless steel blades. Okay. So these are the guards. We're gonna take the guards off. <gasps> What do you want to chop first? They're sharp. Yes, they're sharp. Sharp. What do you want to chop first? Mm. Uh, uh, how about a couple carrots? We'll put some carrots in there. Yeah. Let's chop the carrots. Okay. All right. Do you want to just? Yeah, we can just. Mm. <laughs> you can't do it. No. Really? Okay, yeah. honey, they gotta be smaller than that. Okay, right. that's good. So that's good enough. Okay. Well, I mean, you don't want to just throw a carrot. You know, I don't want to break the thing. I mean, you know, it is plastic. Now we're gonna put this on here. Line, line your thing up. Put it on there. Uh -huh. no, not quite. Oh, you know why? Because I didn't put my blade in there. Right. There we go. Make yeah. sure your blade's in there. It's on the bottom, right? Okay. Really? Put them in there. Mine didn't come with instructions. Now, can you twist this and get it tighter? Tighter? No. You don't want it tight. It just tight. sits there. Okay. okay. Yeah, I mean, okay. it's got to, because right. if it didn't have it on, I mean, right. if it screwed on, you wouldn't, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I, I could be doing this wrong. I don't know. I've never had, never owned one of these. I've always done the old-fashioned way. There we go. There we go. Now, let's turn that. Shouldn't have to do it real quick. Well, just snap. You want to go until it snaps on there. You know what I mean. It says to do it once, and then if you want it finer, you can do it again. So let's get you down here a little bit better. All right. So let's let's try this out. There's one. I don't know what the hell that's about. Uh, 
not real impressed with that thing. Not really doing much on the carrots. Mm -mm. I mean, see, you really can't do it this way, can you? Nope. Okay, so anyway. That's what that is, right? A carrot in there? Um, I don't know. Uh, I not tell you. No, those are peppers. Um, it's probably, maybe not four carrots. I don't know. Yeah. Um, okay, alright. Um, so maybe it's not four carrots. I don't know what you would put in there to chop it up. It's the other side. It is we'll chop. It's for chops and dices fruits and vegetables effortlessly. Effortlessly. Well, so I didn't. Say, it said fruits and vegetables, so you should be able to use it for that. Well, okay, yeah, yeah. I, I understand that. But um, I don't think it was no. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Okay, let's do something else. Okay, what do you want to do? I'm going to chop celery up. Chop celery up. Yeah, we haven't done any celery yet. Okay. So, let's do the celery and something. Alright, um... You want to try the chopper? Yeah, because it says I can do fruits and vegetables. So. Well, I just had a carrot in there and it didn't do very well. No. Very disappointed, really. That big enough? Well, or too I think it's too big, honey. I mean, that's huge. Yeah, but you're not supposed to have to cut it real tiny. I don't. I don't want to try it with this blade because I. I mean, I tried it with the carrot, and I just think it's. I don't know. Um, I'm not sure about that. I'll have to research that a little bit more. I just, um, I don't know, i just not impressed with fruits and vegetables, I don't, I don't get it. Alright, alright, enough of that one. Okay, um, alright. So let's do, since there's already fruit or vegetables in here, now we have this, this little deal here, it goes on, same way, you just stick it on and turn it, locks in, okay, um, let me see, let's, what do you want to do, now this one has an arrow on it, can you see that little arrow there? What you want to do is put the arrow towards this little indentation for your fingers. So it'll go in like like that. Okay? So what do you want to do, hon? Okay. Cucumber. You want to do a cucumber? Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's try a cucumber. Alright. Uh, and this one's a little different, but... So, and... You've got your, what the hell, why did that come off? Maybe it's for certain things, you don't need it all the time. You need it. Oh. <laughs> I, I don't know. Like I said, mine didn't come with instructions, so. <laughs> I mean, it's not hard to research it. No. But, put this in here, and let's do this. And, and again, there's there's an arrow here and an arrow here to go back and forth. It goes this way. Do so. it, baby. Do it. Do it, baby. Do it. Oh, that was nice. Yeah, that cuts up good. And you push the top down. Uh -huh. Look, I think mine got a little closer. Yeah. Than yours did. Mm -hmm. So let's see what we got here. Yeah. yeah, nice, nice. Not bad. And mine's still a little, you know, you can you mm -hmm. can you can use that. Mm hmm Yeah. To where you know, that's what yours did. So yeah, not bad. They're they're about the same there. Um let's see, you wanna do mushroom. You know, mushroom? I was just gonna say I know mushroom. 
All right, let's do a mushroom. Mm, let me see. I don't know which way I should do right. this. Let's try it that way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. <laughs> oh, I have to stand more. All right, let's try this. It's working. It's working? Yeah. Alright. And then you, you know. So, yeah, that's, there's that. Yeah, it's a mushroom. Um, let me see. Do you have a cheese grater in that one? Yeah, this here is a cheese grater. Mm -hmm. So, um, let's try. You know what? Let me see. This is Julian. And that's real fine Julianne. Mm. Julianne. I said Julianne. But, okay. But this, this is like for carrots. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, this is what you're supposed to do with a carrot, I do believe. Smaller. Well, maybe it, it will go bigger. I don't know. There you go. Oh, yeah, it's doing it. Thank you. Oops, it fell off. Oh, that one's getting burned in the trash. Okay, so um, I'm not real impressed with that. Mm -mm. And, you know, I don't know. Like I said, I'll have to play with it and I'll let you guys know on another video. This just seems all dangerous to me. Mm -hmm. See, there's no way to. No. Mm -mm. I mean. No. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. See what it did. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right, so that's kind of a fail. Yeah. All right. Um, let me try something here. Tomato? Um, so that's one we just had in there. Mm -hmm. Let's try the smaller one and see what happens on a carrot. See, you're supposed to be able to put it like that. That worked yeah. fairly decent, but that's all you can get out of it. Mm -hmm. so, so, okay, yeah, that kind of worked. Mm -hmm. Let's try. It might take a little practice, too. You know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get used to it and know what you want to do. And... See, it's... Mm -hmm. but just out of curiosity. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No. No. Right. Mm -hmm. Try the bigger one. So, you know, these are just cheap things. I mean, whatever. But if a couple of them work. That one's better. Right. It's a little bit better. That one better? Mm. Well, it's kind of crooked. Mm -hmm. Straighten it out. Because I'm putting it in crooked. And they can't see nothing. Sorry, guys. Yeah, that works good. At least your hand is covered and safe. Yeah. Stuff like that. I mean, you know, yeah, it's okay. Well, that got down there pretty good. Mm hmm. Sure did. I like that one. Okay, let's see what I it like looks like. One. I mean, it kind of makes a mess, but... A little bit. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's good for salads, I guess. It depends yeah. what you want it for. Yeah. Like I said, I'm not, you know... Okay, 
Dump it in the pan, please. Alright. Alright, let's um let's do the potato. Alright. Looking pretty good. As far as a dicer, I like or slicer, I like yours better. Mm -hmm. um, see, that just got caught in there and then wouldn't do nothing. I mean, it is slicing it up, but yours, I think, as far as the slicing thing of this, I think yours is better. Mm -hmm. I do too. See, this one's just getting right. It's soggy. Um. Well, we didn't. Did we slice the potato in yours? We did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, and then, you know, it's flying out. Okay, so I'm not impressed with that. Now, can that. you make them French fry style like mine? No. No. No, see, that's okay. why I said it's pros and cons. Mm -hmm. right. Um. This is more probably for a salad stuff. You know? Uh, you want to slice and see what it does with the tomato? Yeah. Alright. See, they can't see. I'm, uh, all right. I can't see. You should have been up a little higher. That's what I just said. Well, you were high, and then you brought it down. Yeah, and then... Uh, all right. But I was up too high. Mm -hmm. I can see. That's pretty good. It works good on mm -hmm. tomatoes. So that's about, you know... Not bad. What we had on yours. Uh huh. Yeah. So. Yeah. Worked yeah. good. I think so. And well, let's see what it looks like. Okay. Yeah. It's. Yeah. Well, here I'll just show them. See, look. It, it gets caught. Mine gets caught in here. Mine didn't do that. No, it didn't. Mm -mm. No. See, I mean. It, that yeah, is what it is. Right. All right. Now. Let's try the cheese. Okay, cheese. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead and. So I told you we should have got a bigger pan. You said no. I don't have one. Yeah, we do. We've got big pots in there, honey. Oh, no. One there pan, go. whether it's small or big. All right. Let's, damn it. We haven't done everything yet. No, but okay. I... Oh, but, well, we haven't done everything yet. I know. Okay. Um, let me see. Cheese. Okay. Well, we want the grater? since we got the slicer, let's do the onion. Let's try the onion on the slicer. Okay? Okay. See, the onion... I don't know. I think it might be too big. See, it wouldn't even go in the hole. Oh, yeah, well, there it goes. Yeah, that's good. Mm. Let's see. That's what it looks like. Yeah, it's not bad. I mean, if you, a small onion, that would be all right. You um, put it on a salad or, or you want to um, put it on your hamburger, it'll work okay. 
I cut it in half. Let's try that. Cause I want to be able to sometimes dice it, you know. I mean, right. What would you use for the dicer? Ooh, what's that please. sucker? Huh? That's got holes in it. Mm -hmm. What's that one for? You got one. Are do I? Okay. We did it. Okay, so yeah, that worked pretty good for dicing. Mm -hmm. Not bad, but still not as small as like if you needed for a, um, like for a taco. So, you know, it is what it is. So, <clears throat> told you we needed a bigger pan. All right, let me rinse this out again real quick. Alright. Okay. So so far I'm not real impressed with it. It looks cool, but alright. Now we're going to do what are we doing? Cheese. Okay, the cheese. Here is one cheese grater. Yeah. Hers was metal, this is plastic, so. Uh. Oh, it's doing it, babe. Is it? Yeah. I mean, we could be using wrong cheese, too, but. So. Now it's doing it? Yeah. Yeah, it, it kind of did. Mm -hmm. um, I, I'm, I'm just not impressed with that. I don't want the cheese sitting on The thing, on, the thing I, mean, I don't like is that it slides it's a okay. lot. Well, honey, and honey, you honey, have honey, to honey, hold honey, your hand honey. on it. That's because of this, see? Yeah, but that one had rubber little thingies on the bottom. Oh, it does too. And that didn't seem to slide as much, I don't think. I don't think it did. Will that stay there? Not bad, not bad. Okay, I see. I'm just not, you know, I still like mine better. Okay, so far, yeah, I said so far yours is winning. Okay, I mean, I'm, you know, it's not a competition, I'm just putting these to the test. I mean, they were the same amount of money. So, all right, an onion, or I mean, an egg. Let's do an egg. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> oh. Mm -hmm. No. 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 Nope. <laughs> um, I mean it is, but look how messy that is. You know. Um Okay. Uh let's see. This is a zester. It's supposed to, you know. Okay, that's what that does. I didn't want to get this in the egg. It's alright. I'm going to throw that little bit out. It's no big deal. It's an egg. Yeah, it's zesting it. I can do my lemon for that. Hey. My lime for my drink. Oh, no, you don't want the zest for your drink. But yeah, okay, that, that, that one does work. This works good. That smells good. Okay. I'm this. Now. Okay. Now what we're going to do is, let's see. We're going to we're going to do some egg white. So. Okay. But what we're going to need is we're going to need this egg separator and this deal. Which you can make cake batter, pancake batter, brownie but batter, whatever with that. Okay, so what you want to do 
I wish they just made me stick on better, you know. I mean, I was kind of fit of fucking around with it, you know. To, I mean, it's not bad, but okay. So here's what we're gonna do with this. Care mm -mm -mm. Um, you get your handy dandy egg separator. We all know how to separate eggs. That's a little yolk. Mm -hmm. All right. So the egg separator. It's gonna come out fast. It did yeah. separate it really good. Yeah. Okay. I so like that we do, a little bit. Well, we've got a five dollar egg separator anyway. <laughs> All right. And then we put the handle on here. Let's get you down here so you can maybe see a little better. Let's try this. And that's another thing, these handles don't quit. Right. I mean, I guess for this, um, and this don't have a juice or either. And you just keep going to your consistency or whatever. Um, I mean, it's okay. It's okay, but I mean, if you want to whip that egg into, you know, Egg batter, egg beater blade, make fluffy omelets, tasty whipped cream, and more. I don't know. I just let's make an omelet. I mean, it's good for that. For what we gave for it, yeah, five bucks or whatever they cost original. I'm giving this a thumbs down. I mean, because none of that stuff works, you know. Mm -mm. But, okay. Yeah. You know, there you go. Um, so there it is. I don't think there's anything else I want to try on this. Mm -mm. You know, so. No. I mean, I, I like yours better. What do you think? I like mine better, too. Overall. I'm kind of disappointed in this one. Um, yeah, me too. Because if I'd have gave full price for it, whatever they go for, no, it, it'd go back to the store. Um. I mean, for the money, just to have an egg beater, you know? Yeah, no. No, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. Um, no, it ain't worth it. Um, so anyway, guys, there you go. That's, you know, our little... Putting them things... Our little review. Hers, yeah. Hers, two thumbs up for me. What do you think? Oh, yeah, three thumbs up for mine. Three thumbs up. This Three monkey a, paws. Yeah, this is a really yeah. This I'll, I'll give it a one, one monkey paw. Mm. Um, I'm not sure how to use this blade. I mean, I could be doing it wrong. I don't know, but um, as far as all the other attachments and stuff, no, no. So uh, this one, this one worked. This was a too bad. That yeah, it's worked. for zest. Yeah. How often would you use it though, right? Yeah, you don't use zest to rind for much. Unless you cook all the time. But for the money, I mean, you're going to get one, two things that really work good. Uh, I'm going to give it, just because it does beat an egg, but I can do the same thing with a whisk just as quick and I'll have to, you know, get this all dirty. And then all we got to do is wash a whisk. You know, right. we don't have to wash one, two, three, four different things. Right, and this kept falling off, so. Well, it, it just, it's, yeah. it's made it glossy and clean up there. I mean, you know, if there's one thing you clean, there's another thing, there's two, three, four things you're going to clean to where if you're just going to make an omelet, just use a whisk and you're only cleaning your whisk. Right. So, uh, I'm going to give it two um, bear claws. You give it what? How many monkey paws? 
No monkey paws? Mm -mm. I don't like it Well, at all. It, can, it can be alright in cake batter, though. Yeah. Because this is easier than... It can right. be alright in cake, cake and pancake batter, so at least give it one monkey paw. Okay, I'll give it one mm -hmm. monkey paw, but right. very disappointed. In so, it. all in all, no. I mean, was it worth five bucks? I don't even know if it was worth five bucks to me. So, this is probably going to be given away to someone. <laughs> <laughs> And that way you can do your own thing. And maybe it works good for you guys. I don't know. This is just for me. Not, you know, I'm not saying don't go buy it. I'm saying if you like what, feel like you would like what it did, that's fine. This is just our our opinion on, and on it. And maybe there may, maybe we did something wrong. Maybe they have one that I, they seen us doing it wrong or something. I don't, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. So, I mean, this is going to be, this will be a giveaway item here. So, mm -hmm. we'll do a giveaway on this one. Like I said, that way you guys can give it away. You can do your own video. You can keep it. Whatever you want to do with it. Mm -hmm. yeah, uh, sure. Yeah. So, all right, guys. That's, that's what we're going to, there we go. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's all. So, I mean, what do you think, Mom? No. You, all right. Well, I'm we're done. I'm say I'm out for now, and y'all have a good evening. Yeah. Bye, y'all. And, whoops. <laughs> uh, don't forget to check out Monkey 1000's channel. Um, she's getting some videos up, doing a lot better. She's doing her own editing all by herself now. She has been for a little bit now, so we're proud of her. And I'm going to say um, thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Uh, like I said, you be the judge on these things. I like the one she bought better. Uh, it's got an egg separator, too. And it slices an egg. This thing, yeah, I'm, I'm just not impressed with it. So, all right, guys. Let us know in the comments below if you have one or if you've used one, what you guys think about it. And if you might, might want it to do your own review video. Uh, <laughs> but we'll, we'll show you. We'll tell you about uh yeah, we're gonna have we're gonna have a couple giveaways coming up here soon, so probably about February we'll do a giveaway. Valentine's. Okay, Valentine's, whatever. Yeah. But we'll do a giveaway in February, maybe one or more, so there you go. Alright guys, again, thanks for watching. Right. Shaber one thousand, the myth, the man, the legend, the devastatingly handsome, good looking <laughs> YouTuber. Really, babe? Really? We'll see you guys soon. <laughs> Take care. Bye-bye now. <laughs> You're so cute.